Hello, we are now at lesson two. You need to open up your exercise book and write lesson two. And on the left hand side, the first word we're going to look at hurry, H U R R Y. On the right hand side, get ready to press the pause button. I'm going to show you the word and you'll have to write it down. Arts. Arts. That's a final sadi on the end of the word. Arts. This is the masculine form. Arts. Here we go. I'm going to ask the question and ring the bell. At the bell you can pause, give yourself some time to formulate your answer, and then listen to my possible answer. Me. Arts. Ani arts. Me arts po. Ani arts po. Me arts sham. Arts ani sham. Now, because arts begins with a guttural letter and the vowel comets, when we have the interrogative ha at the beginning, it's not ha, it changes to he. So here we have he arts. Ani sham. Arts. Ani sham. I'll repeat that. He arts. Ani sham. Arts. Ani sham. So to repeat that bit of grammar, the interrogative ha. When prefixed to a guttural that has the vowel comets, that's the long R, ah, it takes the sound E, which is called the segol, the three dots, one, two, three. That's the segol. E. He arts ani sham. He arts. He arts ani bo. Arts ani po. He arts ata sham. Arts ani po. He arts ata po. Arts ani now in the margin write the word return r-e-t-u-r-n and in the right hand side the masculine form in the present shav shav so press pause and write that down shav me Shav Shav Ani Ha Shav Atapo Shav Ani Po Aye Shav Ata Shav Ani po. Now we have a new word for where, W H E R E. So you can write that on your left hand side, W H E R E. It's the third word we have so far. And here it is A. A. Which means the same thing as 
aye, which we've used so far for where. So this is a a where. A dash ata. Dash ani po. A shav ata. Shav ani po. A ba ata. Ba ani sham. Now the feminine form. Hadasha at sham. Dasha ani sham. Had shava at po. Shava. Ani po. The next word is the word for hurry, and that is arts, which we have already seen. So we're going to have some revision with it. Arts, there it is. Arts, hurry. So we don't have to write that one down. Me. Arts. Ani arts. Hey arts. Ata. Arts. Ani. Hey arts. Ata. Sham. Arts. Ani. Sham. Hey at sa at po at sa ani po ay ye at ani po ay ata Ani Sham. I'll repeat those two. Where are you? Aye at Ani Po E Ata Ani Sham. The next word means where to and we have two forms for it here's the first one so on the left hand side write where to w-h-e-r-e -E, and then t-o question mark where to the right hand side this is the first word ana ana and the second word also meaning where to you can write this one down an, an, and this has got a final nun, an, an. So we have ana, ana, and we have an, an, meaning where to. An dash ata. Dash ani po. Ana dasha at. Dasha ani po. Ana zada at. Zada ani sham. Ana ba a at. 
ba a ani sham an tsad ata tsad ani sham an dash ata dash ani po mi tsada po tsada ani po an at ata at ani sham now the next word has the lateral s right so it is this word here which means to position or place so on the left hand side write to position or place or to locate and it is shum sham 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 let's say that again sham so here we go mi sham po ani sham po this is a different s sound it's not the s at the front of your mouth it's a s with your tongue going to the side of your mouth so one side of your tongue hits one side of your mouth giving this sh sound so i'll say it again mi sham po ani sham po ha sham ata po sham ani po ha sham at sham sham ani sham an sham ata sham ani po ana sham at Shama ani sham Now the next question points out quite clearly the difference between the two sounds of the shin and the shin Mi sham 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 ani sham I'll say that again. Mi sham sham. Sham ani sham. Mi ba sham. Ba ani sham. Ha ba ata sham. Ba ani sham. Our next word is the word for run. Here's the masculine form. So on the left hand side you can write run, R U N. And the right hand side, press the pause button and catch this word rats. Rats. Once again ending in a tsadi. Rats. Here come our questions. Mi rats po. Rats 
אני פה. אן רץ אתה רץ אני פה. אנא רצה. רצה אני שם. הרץ אתה שם. רץ אני שם. איה את. אני פה. אי אתה. אני פה. הצד אתה שם. צד, אני פה. מי רצה שם? אני רצה שם. מי דש פה? דש אתה פה. הרצה את שם? רצה אני שם. The next word is judge. That's not a noun but a verb. And here it is. דן. Final noon. דן. This is the masculine form. The feminine would be דנה. So here we go. מי דן פה? Who judges here? מי דן פה? אני דן פה. I judge here. אני דן פה. מי דן שם? דן, אני שם. איה דן אתה. דן, אני פה. אי דן אתה. דן, אני שם. הדן, אתה פה. דן, אני פה. הדנה, אני שם. דנה, את שם. מי דנה פה? דנה, אני פה. אי דן אתה. דן אני פה. And the last word in this lesson we're going to look at is the word for get up or arise. So write that in your left hand margin. Get up, arise. And here we have it in the masculine form. קום. קום. With a kuf, qam, and a final mem, qam. So here we go. Mi qam. Ani qam. Ha qam ata. Qam ani. Ha qam ata po. קם אני פה. מי קמה שם? קמה 
anisham. Hakama at po. Kama ani po. And that brings us to the end of the lesson. Unfortunately, my computer screen just blipped out there, so I had to get up and do something. <laughs>